They say Muslims invented algebra, medicine, and optics. But is that really true? Or is it just another myth? Let's dive into 9th century Baghdad, Al-Khwarizmi writing on parchment. Algebra, the name itself comes from Arabic, Al-Jabr. Al-Khwarizmi systematized it, but did he invent it? The Greeks had equations, the Indians had zero. Algebra was evolving, but Muslims perfected it and spread it. But the European scholars centuries later translating Arabic works. And why is that? Because Europe wouldn't have algebra without Muslim scholars. But did they create it from nothing? No. Ibn Sina's canon of medicine became the foundation of medieval Europe's medical schools. Al-Zarawi's surgical tools still in use today? But medicine didn't start with them. Muslim scholars took ancient knowledge, expanded it, and preserved it when Europe was in chaos. And optics? Ibn al-Haytham revolutionized it. He developed the modern scientific method centuries before Europe's scientific revolution. No guessing, no philosophy, just pure experimentation. Without him, cameras and modern physics wouldn't exist. But again, he didn't invent optics from nothing. He pushed it forward. So, did Muslims invent these fields? No. Did they revolutionize them and spread them globally? Absolutely. Now tell me, why don't we talk about this part of history? Was the Islamic golden age overrated or underestimated? Let's debate.